Hello and welcome to CSS 27, Java Programming 2 Data Structures. My name is Alex Starkov. I am your instructor. Uh, in front of you, you see the class homepage where you will find the start and end dates of the class, important deadlines, uh, the location, and what time the class meets for the face-to-face -face section if there is a face-to-face -face section during the semester. Uh, of course, the times as well. The preferred uh, way to contact me is using this email. Please include CSS27 and the subject lines of all your emails to me. Please take the time to read the welcome message. It explains important logistics and uh, such as due dates. Also, please read the syllabus. Import it explains things about the uh, grading rubric for this class, as well as textbooks. There will be office hours during the semester, regular uh, spring and fall semesters. I will also post uh, tutors' availability for the semester soon. I have a forum for you to build a sense of community, help each other, share information, ask each other questions. And this is all, of course, on top of me. I am your number one uh, line of support. If you have any issues, technical issues, or if you get stuck on anything class-related, please let me know. I'll, I'll get back to you within 24 hours on weekdays, 48 hours on weekends. Underneath, you'll see the class content is broken down into 16 weeks with a link for each of these weeks and a topic that we will be covering for each of these week, weeks. You will see the dates where each of these weeks starts and ends so that you can check your calendar and know where you are during the semester. If I wanted to go to a specific week, I can just click on the link. And for example, right now I'm in week four. Okay, with week four, just like most of the weeks, you will see the similar format. I will tell you what you're going to learn I will tell you what you need to read and watch in order to learn this. And then I'll have some assignments for you to demonstrate that you have learned this and so that you can become comfortable with the topics and ideas that have been presented. The next thing to notice is that for each of the weeks on the bottom, there's a previous and a next. You can navigate between the weeks that way. Okay. And uh, you can always go back to the home page and jump to a specific week instead of having to go forward, forward, forward. Okay, so that is uh, how the class is going to be organized. That is how you're going to navigate through the class. Uh, just let's have an example of uh, some things. So, for example, let's say in this week you're going to learn some things about sorting. And in here you're going to have to do some program to do some sorting, something. Uh, and I need to submit an assignment. So let me show you how to submit an assignment. You click the submit button, scroll down, choose the file that you need to submit. Let's say you're going to be submitting a Java file, right? And you're going to submit that file and you will be able to see the file in the top right corner of your assignment. You can resubmit the file, but your previous submission will be hidden from you. Okay, so just keep that in mind. Once your file has been submitted, check your grades. Check your grades frequently and always uncheck this thing, this checkbox first, in order to see your true grade. Okay, so here's my salmon 3. I've submitted it. Uh, when the instructor grades it, which is when I grade it, right, you will see if, if your assignment does not get a 10 out of 10 or 100%, for example, then to the right of it, you will see a little box with my feedback that will explain to you why points were lost so that you can fix and resubmit your assignment for full credit. So I'll repeat that again. You're welcome to resubmit all of your assignments up to two times for full credit. This allows you to perfect your skills. It opens up more work for me, but it allows you to do better. So I hope you appreciate that. Okay, so if you ever get stuck, if you have any questions, if you're in doubt about anything, send me your, uh, send me your emails. Okay, so these are all the assignments and your grades. 
uh, I have also organized all the assignments in the assignments tab right in addition to assignments being organized in the home page by weeks by topic I also have them assign all the assignments in one place or in the assignments tab and similar to this all these quizzes are in the quiz tab okay so grades home assignments and jumping through the different weeks that's pretty much what you have to do to navigate through this class so if you have any questions please let me know and I look forward to working with you during the semester